What's up YouTube, Pete here from the Sunday Drive, and today I'm gonna to show you how to remove the front bumper from my C7 Corvette. The reason we're doing that is because I'm replacing this stock front grille with this Z06 front grille that I purchased off of eBay. I got this from Extreme Online Store, and I'll have the link to that in the description of the video below. So, let's get started. So the first thing we're gonna do is remove these 10 seven millimeter bolts along the front of the bumper. After removing the 10 seven millimeter bolts, go ahead and remove the four middle 10 millimeter bolts behind this plastic lip. When you take this last 10 millimeter out, this middle plastic piece will try to fall, so just hold it up. Every time you remove bolts, and go ahead and slide this back and out. After you move this plastic tray, there are five seven millimeter bolts on the bottom that you need to remove that separates the air intake from the bumper. Go ahead and pop your hood. Once you're under the hood, you can remove these two side plastic pieces. They just clip in. Just wiggle them out. Here you can see the clip that they use on the passenger side and pull out the driver side. And as you can see, the clip is a little bit different. There's four T30 screws along the front and two plastic fasteners that you need to remove. Now, come under your wheel well and you'll see that there's three T15 screws that need to be removed. A tool like this DeWalt 90 degree adapter is really useful for getting into tight spaces. If you're interested in this, we'll have a link in the description. Once you remove these three T15s, you can go ahead and pull away the bumper. It clips in very carefully and you can just barely see in here there's an electrical connection. If you sneak your hand in here you can unplug the corner marker so the driver side's unclipped now we can come around to the passenger side and pull that away as well Go ahead and disconnect the passenger side electrical connection. So these are the only two electrical connections, at least for my Corvette, because it's a base Stingray. If you have um, the option with the front facing cameras or the performance data recorders, then you're probably gonna have to unplug those as well. Uh, that should not be hard to get to at all, but for us, that's all. On the top of the bumper, there's two clips holding it in on each side. One very close to the headlight, right around where this crease is, and the other one right here where the engine bay starts. You can actually see this inner clip, but the outer clip you cannot. We're going to start by prying between the headlight and the bumper to get under it. And use that to get a bigger pry tool in there. And once that's under there, now we're going to pry out the inner clip. And you're going to want to try to pull straight up. Just like that. This outer clip can be a bear. Just apply a constant force and then try to start wiggling this pry tool and it should release. And after you release these clips on each side, the bumper should come off. So the bumper is ready to be removed. You want to go on each side of the fenders, sure that it's totally released. Now the bumper should slide out and forward. And 
And there you go, that's how you remove the front bumper. So now we're gonna show you how to remove the front grill and replace that with the Z06 front grill. Okay, so flip your bumper to the inside. And you'll see there's two seven millimeter bolts that need to be removed first. Next, you're gonna remove these two outer clips. To do that, you'll need a flathead screwdriver to depress it and push it out. Now, go around the perimeter of the front grille and release all of these clips. Now, you're gonna to wanna to work your way in from the outside on one end and go to the other side. Next, make sure that you install these clips with the nuts installed on them to the grill. Go ahead and install the new and improved Z06 front grill. Now this grill does come with some extra hardware for you to install. These plastic panels um, can be installed on the corners of the Z06 grill. They're actually labeled left hand and right hand, if you can see that right here. I don't know if every kit comes with this, but the kit that I ordered on eBay does. This is something that comes with the factory car. These panels are there. Also included is a bag of hardware to screw them in. Really tiny screws. And here you go, here's the new grill on the front bumper. So now we can go ahead and reinstall it on the car. and make sure that everything on the bottom is tucked above the bumper too. So there you go, that's how you remove the front bumper and install a Z06 front grill or replace your grill if you're looking to do that. Um, as you can see, it's not too complicated, only a handful of screws and bolts and then a bunch of clips that you just have to be careful of. If there's anything else that you'd like to see me do to my Corvette, Feel free to let us know and we'll try to get to it. We would have a lot of ideas that we want to do to this car, but we'd also like to help you guys out as well. So let us know. If you found this video to be helpful, please give us a big like and subscribe and thanks for watching.